Is Space Force really leaving Colorado Springs? Hi, this is Jason Daniels with Finch and Gable Real Estate Company, and we just got the information that Space Force Space Command will be leaving Colorado Springs most likely. The good news is we do have temporary location for at least three to four or five more years. However, it was just announced last week that Huntsville, Alabama, Redstone is going to be housing the permanent headquarters for Space Command. So really it's been upsetting to a lot of the local politicians here, um, our mayor, the governor. Um, it's a big economic impact. So yes, as of last week, they've just announced the move that's going to take place over the next three to five years. It's going to have a $450 million impact in our local community, including 1,400 jobs, 40% which are active duty, 60% are civil service. On top of that, there's probably going to be hundreds, if not several thousand jobs tied to the contractors that service the military for Space Command here in Colorado. So ultimately, it's not going to be great for future economic growth. However, we do have good news. Um, they're still going to remain here for three to five more years. And I just read an article that the final decision won't be made until 2023. So if the new administration comes in, they may change that. So there are some people holding out hope that the Air Force and that the next president will change their mind to keep Space Command right here in our backyard in Colorado Springs. With five military installations, this is a great place for it. And, you know, Colorado's a beautiful state. So we're gonna hope for that. But what does that mean for housing? There's a developer, Flying Horse uh, East, was gonna develop 3,500 home sites right around Trevor Air Force. This may put that on hold. We don't know. Only time can tell what's gonna happen. However, In N Out Burger has brought several hundred uh, jobs and they're bringing more into the distribution center. Uh, we've got jobs coming in from Amazon, 4 million square foot building. It's the largest building of its kind in the four state region. They're bringing over a thousand new employees. Shields Sporting Goods is bringing three to 400 jobs here in the next couple months. We have companies from all over that are opening up locations and distribution centers and coming to Colorado Springs anyway. So ultimately we will be fine uh, if Space Command does relocate but it is going to be an impact of somewhere between $450 million to $800 million a year in economic impact just from that. So hopefully we can recover. I know some of you, it's a sigh of relief. We've had such low inventory with housing. However, this all is not going to play out probably in for another three to five years. So stay tuned. We'll see what happens. If you have any questions about the real estate market or how uh, things will change with the uh, economy, Feel free to reach out to us. Keep watching our videos. We appreciate your support. And in the meantime, stay safe, and we'll see you on the next video. Go ahead. Space Force, play me something Space Force-y. <laughs> it's kind of Space Force-y. What else you got, buddy?